Welcome back for another Forzathon, the Spring Forzathon. This weekly challenge, it's pretty straightforward. There's one challenge that I want to focus on. We're going to quickly go through the other three chapters. And first thing you always want to remember is you have to do the chapters in order. And you also really want to complete this weekly Forzathon because it will reward you with either 100 or 200 Forzathon points. Forzathon points are big this week because the Spring Forzathon shop is awesome. If you haven't seen that yet, I'll definitely have a video linked in the description to that. Now, the Lake Lodge house is a house you definitely want to get before doing this if you have the credits for it. If you don't, it is what it is, but you'll get 200 Forzathon points instead of 100. It doubles everything that earns you Forzathon points in the game, whether that's daily challenges or Forzathon Live as well. Now, for this weekly spring Forzathon, we're going to have to use a GT car, so filter for that at the auto show or my cars, not Super GT. GT cars. I ended up going with the Bentley Continental Super Sports. It's one of the rare cars that has a 6x multiplier as a perk, and it's also at the auto show. I wanted to use a car that literally anybody can get, and for a pretty reasonable price it can also be found at the auction house, but it's at the auto show for pretty cheap, and it's a car that I know anybody can get. Not everyone can get the Forza editions and some of the other exclusive cars that are in this car category, I just wanted to find one that had the higher multiplier. You want to make sure you go to the car mastery and put all of the skill perks on. Everything that has to do with skill perks, you don't have to do ones that have to do with racing and aren't going to help you with what we need to get done here. Now for chapter 1, you just literally get into your GT car, leave the festival, and then chapter 2, you have to win two street scene events. Now to unlock these, if you don't have street scene races unlocked yet, all you have to do is head-to-head -head race against Dravatars, drive up behind them, challenge them to races, and beat them. After you unlock the street scene races, you can filter your world map for them, figure out which ones you want to do, you can pick any of the races you want to, and you can literally use any difficulty settings that you want to use. So difficulty, put it to new racer, traction control on, whatever you need to do to win, just make sure you do that. You have to win the two races, and once you do that, chapter two will be complete. Chapter three is the big one, the one that we're going to focus on. You need to earn one million skill score to complete chapter three. My favorite spot, what I think the best spot is, the most fun spot, is the Greendale Airstrip. You just saw the location on the map. To get 1 million skill score, you have to get 167,000 skill score. Multiply that by the six times multiplier you're gonna have from the car mastery, and that will give you the 1 million. I highly recommend getting the Huntman's Lodge house. This gives you skill songs, which I never use because I don't have my radio on, but basically the DJ will allow your skill multiplier to go way higher when you have a skill song playing. So if you have a car that it can only go to a five or a six multiplier, it goes up to like 10 or 12 or something crazy like that. So it makes it way quicker and easier to get challenges like this done. So if you can afford them, it's very helpful. Both of the houses I mentioned in this video, the Lake Lodge and the Huntman's Lodge, I just know that not everyone's gonna be able to afford them. That's why I'm showing a way that everybody can get this done, just in case you don't have the best of the best things to get this challenge complete. But literally just drift around the Greendale airstrip, slide around, hit into things, wreckage skills, drift skills. Those are the things that string your chain together the most. You just got to get up to that 167,000, and then chapter 3 will be complete. Chapter 4, again, straightforward. Drive 15 miles, get back in your car, keep driving around until you go 15 miles, and once you're done the Forzathon, once you get your Forzathon points, hopefully you're going to have enough saved up to go to that Forzathon shop to get the Rasion and the Gia. That is it. That is the Spring Weekly Forzathon. I really hope that everyone found this video to be helpful or useful in one way or another. If you still have any questions at all, please just let me know in the comment section. As always, thanks for watching. Peace, guys.